Are you interested in and or looking for a desktop computer microprocessor? You can check out the Advanced Micro Devices Ryzen 9 5900 XT computer microprocessor. Web page Uniform Resource Locator is highlighted on screen, amd.com. The Advanced Micro Devices Ryzen 9 5900 XT. I believe they have a 5800 XT and it might cost a little bit less but I'm not going to go over that one in this video let's cut directly to the chase general specifications now this is designed I believe for the AM4 type socket which I think is a little bit older than the AM5 the advanced mark devices Ryzen 9 5900 XT Ryzen family is the 5000 series it's a box processor it's designed for desktop computers designed for gaming and content creation is for consumer use available globally the code name is Vermeer architecture is Zen 3 the number of central process unit cores is 16 it does have multi threading capability number of threads the number 32 now the base clock is the number 33 3.3 gigahertz Level 1 cache is 1 megabyte, level 2 cache is 8 megabytes, level 3 cache is 64 megabytes. 12 nanometer die. The compute die is 74 millimeters, and let's see, the number 3 package die count 3. Yeah, the CPU socket type is AM4, which is older, but if you have that type of socket, central processing socket you will be able to use this microprocessor it supports the X570, B550, A520, X470, B450 has the X86-64 instruction sets there's not that many computers out there that you know support 32 which is X86 but you know the extensions are on screen thermal solution not included the maximum temperature is 90 degrees Celsius and the operating system support on screen they even support Linux connectivity for universal serial bus 3.2 generation 2 up to 10 gigabits per second ports it looks like no okay so I'll skip over the ones that are not available that are not compatible two SATA ports one or PCI Express version 4 and this is more technical details it does have NVMe support boot RAID RAID 1 and RAID 10 dynamic data rate memory version 4 two memory channels maximum memory is 128 gigabytes that this microprocessor supports dual inline memory module maximum memory speed let's see two add dynamic data rate for either 3200 2933 or 2667 now it does I'm not gonna go over that most people don't need to worry about error correction but the, but the motherboard but if the motherboard supports it this microprocessor does support it now graphics capabilities discrete graphics card required so this is just the computer microprocessor obviously designed for desktop computers the AM socket 4 which is older socket but they still provide central processing units that will fit in that socket but you'll have to have your own graphics card you know what I'm saying product identifications key features supported technology advanced market devices Zen 3 core Architecture, advanced micro devices, store, MI technology, master utility, and virtual reality ready. Now it says view specs. I think this is a separate page. Yeah, I think so. I have about, I have quite a bit of time remaining. Yeah, let's go back. anything else the box the cardboard box yep 
Yep, that's a selling point. Yeah, on this page there is no images of the actual microprocessor, but you know, it's just a microprocessor, but you know. It says high end performance for creators and gamers. Let's see, did I skip any? Yeah, some of them, you know, a lot of people may not be interested and a lot of people may not even need to know a lot of these specifications, you know what I'm saying? Now, you know what? I'm going to go over what it doesn't support as far as the connectors. It does not support Universal Serial Bus 3.2 Generation 1, the 5 gigabits per second port, but it supports the 10 gigabits per second, so it's faster, more well, more bandwidth. It does not support Universal Serial Bus 2.0, 480 megabits per second. That's probably a good thing. Yeah, look at the difference between USB 2.0 and even 3.2 Generation 1, although 3.2 Generation 2 is actually 10 gigabits per second, you know. Let's see. They don't stipulate anything else that, that it does not support. Yeah, the PCI Express lanes, 24, 20, total, usable, 20. Additional us usable PCI Express lanes for motherboard, the Advanced Market Devices, X570 or X470, 16 times Generation 4, or 2 times Generation 3, 8 times Generation 2. What else? This, yeah, I went over the the dynamic or the dual inline memory module, which is the sim, system memory type. Oh, error correction. I did go over that, I think. Yeah. Did I skip anything else as far as... Oh, the... The processor technology for central processing cores is TSMC 7 nanometers. The I went over that one. The compute die is 74 millimeters. The input output die size is 125 millimeters. There there are disclaimers for some of these. Yeah, I don't I don't ever give out advice and never guarantee that I never recommend anything. I I choose not to even talk about that. I now I don't certain subjects I ch just choose not to talk about in these videos. And that's one of them on screen there. And you know. No. Nope. Thermal solution not included. Oh, the supported extensions AES, AMD, V, AVX, AVX2, and, and not as a management item. Okay, I think that's enough. That is this video pertaining to this. Advanced Micro Devices Ryzen 9 5900 XT computer microprocessor. Remember, it is. Kind of, you know, it's designed for content creators and video gamers. Adios!